All right. Hey. How's it going? It's good. You call me out here. Tell me something. Yeah, I did. Check out how good this truck looks. Mm-hmm. Doesn't that thing so look good? So good. You don't sound convinced. <laughs> oh. Y'all, you need to help me. She doesn't like my red truck. And that hurts my feelings. But no, that ain't what I called you out here for. Okay, let's do it. Did you see the YouTube thing? What do you mean? The, the YouTube. The, did you see the notification? I know you get these notifications. You didn't get it. I didn't get it, no. Okay, well, YouTube. We have 2,000 views on our last, on our reunion race video. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. But YouTube has finally started paying us <gasps> to make videos. What? Yeah, check Yay! this out. Look, we made $9.36. <gasps> I mean, you Yay! guys have no idea how much parts that's going to buy for this, this red truck. This is big. It's a big, big deal. I mean, we We just, have been accepted for monetization. We have. <gasps> and we've just been working on that for like three and a half years or something like that. I don't even know. But yeah, we're, we're finally we, making money. We're official now. We are on our way. Yeah. So I think, I think that's probably a reason to celebrate. Has, uh, have you told Steven? No, I haven't. We should go tell him. Let's go tell him. Okay. Is he wealthy? <laughs> Oh, man. What's he doing? We gotta go tell him. But <laughs> check out this sign. Hold on. If you need welding, call me at, there's his phone number. If you, it's an emergency, call 911. <laughs> that's, that's how you know it's a good welding shop right there. Put the welder down. What are you doing? <laughs> working. Working. Hey, you don't have to work anymore. Steven, right. we got big news. Yeah, because we have started making money off of YouTube. Like a bunch of money? Yeah. Like, you can quit. You can shut this shop down. How much you gonna pay me? You don't have to work another day in your life. We're done. Yep, that's it. We're all set for life. Really? Yeah, they just told me this morning that they're gonna start paying us. And let's see here. How much was it again? Uh, show him, show him. Where's it at? Oh, look. We made nine bucks already. Dang. Nine dollars and 36 cents to be exact. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit. <laughs> but we're, we're done. Me, I'm done. <laughs> Quit waiting for life. Oh. No more well. We're done. I don't have to no more. You don't have I've to. I've been relieved in my welding duties. <laughs> so, so, I, her, I think it's reason to celebrate. We need to go get something good for lunch. I mean. Yeah, like we eat a turkey sandwich every day. And, rotisserie well, chicken yeah, sandwich we, too. We, we get a rotisserie chicken sometimes. But. Oh, we might have to put a little money with that thing. Eat good though. No, $9 is a lot of money. Yeah. That's a lot. Taco Bell. Yeah, it gets you a lot of Taco Bell. I like Taco Bell. So we're good. Let's go. Let's go celebrate. Oh, we right. might as well. I mean, we're, we've made it. We've made it. We it's lunchtime. Yeah, it is lunchtime. Let's go. <laughs> Y'all, this is the best place to eat in town. Yep. So that's what we're eating. It's the best place ever. Yep. Here we are. Josie's taco truck. It's not <laughs> Josie's. Oh. It's Jose's. Oh. There it is. Man, it's good. This is our treat. This yeah. is our treat. They got this green sauce, oh. and it is the bomb. Let's go. Hello. Hello. <laughs> he just said hello in Spanish. Did you hear that? She said hello, and he said hello. Hello. People think when they talk to someone that talks Spanish that they need to talk in Spanish. It's just the accent. It's like a, you the can't give like me a, a hard time because your Mexican accent is Chinese. It's Spanish. It ain't Mexican. His Spanish accent is Chinese. He goes, hi, uh, jing song. <laughs> <laughs> Why do we feel the need to do that? You feel like it helps. And you got to yell at him, too. Go There's ahead. no reason. We have order for Hannah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Done. 
<laughs> okay. So what is it we order here? Yeah, we don't so. order the tongue. We tell them to hold the tongue. <laughs> hold, hold the tongue, but we like the, the burritos. Yeah. Yes. Hold the tongue. <laughs> The, the, the green. green sauce? The green sauce. Okay. Yep. Okay. And then can we add a uh, Diet Coke to the order? I got lunch. Just one? Yep. How much was it? YouTube's going to pay for it. Okay. I hope it's under $9.80. <laughs> it's okay if it's not. Okay. Okay, it's $39.00. $39.00. We just... Oh, well, it, we made $9.00 like one day, so... Yeah, we'll, we'll make up back. for it tomorrow. We'll get it back. <laughs> this, is, this is so going to be worth it, though. We're in the hole now. <laughs> yes. This is, this is going to be well worth it. All right. you're ever in Waynesville, stop at this little truck on the corner by Burger King. Thank you, YouTube. This is good. Thanks for watching, y'all. Keep watching. <laughs> we need it. Don't let up. Tell your buddies. All right. So lunch was awesome. Lunch was uh, really good. But in all seriousness, uh, we appreciate you guys watching. Um, and if you, ha if this is the first time you've ever seen one of our videos, go back and watch a whole bunch more. Uh, and make sure you subscribe. Um, but obviously, we're not millionaires. We're not. We didn't. We're not planning on making a whole lot of money off YouTube. But it is pretty neat that that they're paying us. Yeah. Um, so for the first day to start making nine bucks, that's that's all right. I'll take it. Um, but yeah, we're still going to continue on with uh, with our day jobs. I'm going to continue working on the red truck, and we're going. <laughs> he's going to continue welding. I guess. And uh, we're going to continue building his house. Um, but yeah, it's just uh, just pretty neat. They started started paying us. You got anything to this? Yeah. Um, we, we were kind of, I kind of panicked a little bit before we went to that race last weekend and I had a bunch of stuff to do to my car that I had put off doing. So, um, we didn't, anyways, we didn't get the video out on this thing, but if you want to put those videos in here of the work that I did, um, the From night, a week or, week or so ago? Yeah, it was about, yeah, two weeks ago. Okay. I know the truck's like 32 years old or something like that. And it's been sitting, like I said, for about 10 years in the weeds. But I didn't know that I was gonna find all this stuff that I'm finding. Um, had the window replaced, you know, it looks great. But when the guys took the cowl off underneath the windshield, uh, found a lot of junk in there and even found a snake skin. I'm not big on snakes. Um, and so I started cleaning the cow out and I thought, you know, that goes to the, to the duct work. And I thought, yeah, I should probably check that stuff too. So I just took the blower motor off and uh, yeah, found some more stuff. So there's the, there's the blower motor. It, um, it's got some stuff in it. That's that's not going to blow real nice air. And then we got this. Just caked full of insulation. I don't know, maybe on this model that's how they that's how they designed it to be full of insulation, but I don't I don't think so. I just really hope I don't find a, something alive in there. But Gotta, gotta get that cleaned out. All right, so that got a little out of hand. Um, got the whole air box 
out of the truck now and all right just something about me seeing mouse poop and bunch of insulation i just kind of blacked out there and had to get rid of all of it so i uh, got a bunch in the trash got every piece of the air box out here and i've cleaned it with some awesome and some dawn soap and it should be good should be clean now did not plan on having to do all that i just did but I'm glad I did now because it's clean and it smells great in here. And I cleaned all the duct work, put it all back in, put a new blower motor in. While I was in there, I replaced the heater core and the EVAP core. So everything behind the dash should be good now. It's clean, it smells good, and I think it even works pretty good. Oh yeah, blows good. Smells great. So, didn't really want to have to do that, but I did. Oh, and a very important box came in. We got the Holly in the building. It's not installed at all, but I did just go ahead and snap that screen in there while I was putting the dash in. Um, and I tore the rear axle out of it because I'm dumb and I can't can't leave things alone. But got the holly, so things are gonna start heading in the right direction now. And maybe this thing will be running before too long. I don't know. But I pulled the rear axle out because we're putting, um, swapping out the gear. I think these trucks come factory with like a 342 rear gear and I don't really need it to get that great a fuel mileage, so we're gonna put a 410 in the rear end, and with the bigger tires, it should it should equal out. But I think a 410 with a uh, five speed should be pretty fun. So Holly's the next project, and I've been working on getting the electric fan and the radiator mounted. And don't look at it too much; it's really dirty right now. But this is a fan out of like a 2009, 2007 Silverado or Tahoe or something like that. And the same for the radiator. So dual electric fans and I got, got a nice harness um, that plugs right into it. So that'll be cool. And I even got the coolant tank mounted. This is, this is not anything for this truck. I found that on Amazon for I don't know, 20 or 30 bucks. I think it might be for like a Buick or something. But with these radiators, you know, they don't have a, a cap mounted to them. So a lot of guys will come off this hose right here and put a, like a radiator cap in line. And I don't, I don't too much like that. So this is gonna be kind of like the factory setup on a newer model truck. You know, the coolant hose will, come down here and tie into the water pump where it goes to the heater core and all that. So it should work, should work pretty good, but got that, got a bracket made for that and got it mounted there. So that's, that's good. But I think I'm going to work on figuring out this Holly and seeing what else I need to do. Uh, I'll say some fancy wires. You done something. I, I did got something. got labeled and everything. Yeah. Check that out. Connect the cylinder head. So, got the poly system installed. And now this thing's just about ready to... Vanna White. <laughs> what? She asked if I was Vanna White. Uh, yeah. Yes. So the engine's about ready to drop in. Um, come in here and I'll show you the... Oh, and the windows are tinted. Got the new front windshield Ooh. in. Got the windows tinted. So it's starting to look like something now. It sure is. Easy. <laughs> the interior's still not in it, but I do have door panels, and those look pretty good. Um, but if you'll come over here. So the key works. I got the little Holly dash mounted over there. So that that works. Oh, it's a... Oh. Radio's working. Radio's working. 
I don't have the antenna hooked up, but the radio works. Um, and look at this. It looks like it was made this way from the factory. There's the computer. Oh. It's all functional. The glove box still works. Is that a cup holder? In yeah. You said you look. While you're riding down oh the road. Goodness. That won't bounce, will it? That won't go nowhere. <laughs> That's there. Yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> they thought that through. Not needed. That's when you park and you're going to sit and eat yeah. lunch or something. Yeah, or when okay. you parked out by the lake. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, or our pond. See. Or the pond, yeah. Yeah, the pond's done. We See, there's another update. Yeah. We're just, we keep forgetting about all this stuff. But the truck is, uh, the truck's coming along. Here in a little while, I'm going to drop a, drop the engine transmission in it. And it'll be driving down the road soon. A little mm -hmm. while, bang, after we get the roof on my house. Okay. okay. Preferably oh, yeah. with the big machine rented. <laughs> you know, I gotta get up there. Yeah. It's a beautiful day. Like so, coke okay. Yes. Alright, we're gonna get back to work. So y'all go I'll I'll come we'll come we'll do a, a house update. Okay. Here in a few minutes I'll come up there and get you guys working. Okay. Hey. Hey. We're being safe. Okay. How's it going? We bought harnesses off Amazon. Oh, that's encouraging. Yeah. We'll, uh, we'll What's it down. hooked to? We'll be done. We're hooked to each other. Yeah. That way, if one of us falls, we both fall. <laughs> okay. I got you, brother. <laughs> no, we're just kidding. We're we're hooked over there. So I'm hooked here. I think my feet would barely touch if I hit the ground right now. My rope's so long. Yeah. We'll be down in just a minute. Okay. It don't look steep up there, but I imagine that that's what it's like to climb Mount Everest. Oh yeah. Those people that do that. Oh yeah. So. And mm. it's hard to breathe up there like Mount Everest. Yeah. Wow. My Pandora don't work really good up there. I mean, it's high. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> do you wanna go beside the machine or what? I don't know. We told them we'd work on wind noise. But here we are and well, it ain't gonna be it ain't windy today or we wouldn't be doing this. It's just a Can little bit of a 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 little bit of the house. Um, as you can tell, we got one side of the roof on. You can't um, tell. Well, yeah, you could tell when you were out there. And we were standing on it, so it's got something on it. Okay. Um, we got some windows in. They're nice. You can see right through them. Just like you'd want a window, really. Yeah. Um, I can't remember where we left off last time. You were still in that machine, so. What machine? Oh, yeah, over here. Over yeah. Machine. We was, uh... Oh, doing like the overhangs and yeah, stuff? Yeah, doing the overhangs. Yeah. So we got the window boxes in, and we got the roof on it. We gotta do the other half of the roof and then we'll be We'll have that done today. And then we can send this big honker back. Yeah. That's what we're trying to do. We 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 got it until Monday. Oh. See, building a house by yourself really ain't that expensive because it's just you ain't gotta pay a whole bunch of people to do it. But when it gets expensive is when you build really big houses, really tall houses, and you have to use expensive equipment to stand those houses up. So mm. You got to be really. What gets expensive is when you rent those machines and then you go racing <laughs> all the time. I don't know what he's talking about. We were supposed to take the month What's off that? when we had that machine rented. 
Uh-uh. When those go back, we can go back to racing, but. Hmm. No. <laughs> no. Actually, I think we're going to go racing next week. Really? No. Oh. I'm just kidding. That's good. Um, but you got to be real efficient when you're building these houses because we get we got this thing for a month. We're probably going to have this thing for two months. Um, and you just don't want to have it longer than what you have to have it. So. Yeah. That's some good That's sound good. advice. Yeah, yeah you, when you, you wished you did and you didn't. And, had it and wished you did, didn't had it, had it and wished you did. Yeah, anyway.